In today's video, we're gonna talk about this 2021 Toyota 4Runner TRD Pro. So just a friendly reminder to please subscribe to our YouTube channel. This way you're up to date on all the cool cars that we're getting into our shop, like this beautiful Toyota 4Runner TRD Pro. It has a Fox suspension and a very unique color. It's a Lunar Rock. So let's get ready and we're gonna start filming it right now. So we have our newest team member, we got Brian here helping us out and getting the TRD Pro ready for paint protection film. We will be doing our, our full Expo uh, paint protection film on all the paint surfaces from the windshield forward. So everything here, this whole nose will get wrapped along with uh, along with the rear view mirrors. So before we get into any of that, obviously we gotta get it washed, we gotta get it prepped. And that's what Brian is gonna be doing right here, helping me get this car ready, cleaned, clayed. And we're gonna take off a couple of pieces on the hood so like that we have a better seamless install. So we have a lot of work to do and Brian can't wait to knock this out for me. So I'm gonna let him do his thing and I'll wait for you guys inside once we're ready to install the paint protection film. And we're also doing one last service to it, but you guys stick around for the rest of the video to find out exactly what we're doing to it. So beautiful lunar rock color. This color I believe is a very uh, unique color for this year. I believe every year the Forerunner comes out with a, a specific color or uh, a unique color. And this year is this Lunar Rock. It's a combination of the military green with the gray cement color. It's a nice blend of both. And you have this cool Lunar Rock paint that my customer can't wait to get it protected so he could drive better and safer knowing that the film is on the paint. So without further ado, let's get ready. I'll wait for you guys inside. <music> actually getting some of this paint correction process done. This way we encapsulate the finish with the highest uh, gloss possible and with as little defects on the paint as well. Here we have our set. He's also helping us polish the Forerunner before we put the paint protection film on. So now we're getting ready to install the bumper pieces. There's two bumper areas on this one. Well, actually there's a couple of pieces. Uh, the top piece, which we already put on, this middle piece right here, and then the two side pieces. Um, we got ahead of ourselves and uh, we're pretty busy, so I, I couldn't have PJ here filming us doing it, so at least we're gonna get this one. Come here close and see how we actually, uh, the expelled DAP um, cutter actually went right there. It's, it's almost, it's, I don't know, it's so close you can't even tell. It, it looks like a barber cut. And we have these new uh, drapes from Expel and they work fabulous. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you on the next door how we did it. How we did it. They have these magnetic uh, strips on this side so you could attach while you could actually uh, gingerly and it has the uh, velcro straps right here very well thought of and the in and the in inside here is very velvety like I don't know what material they use but it's very soft and the reason why we put these drapes on is to minimize the uh, the the watering down here on the control panels and all these new cars that have controls and just minimize that amount of water that comes down here stay tuned we're gonna do the next side all right so while I have Ricky over there working on the ceramic window tint I'm setting up the, the film because we are doing the paint protection film. I'm setting it up to do the full hood. As you saw, we already took off the scoop so we could um, do the, the cut here and actually uh, try to 
you know, tuck in as much possible. We did the cut, we're gonna do the cut here so we could tuck in the film as much as possible inside so there's very little seams. And of course, we're gonna do it the bulk style. This way we have all the extended edges, wrap it underneath once the film has fully cured. Seems like Rick is setting up over there, almost done with the window tint. Uh, yeah, so we're gonna definitely be protecting this Lunar Rock uh, paint with this beautiful glossy paint protection film from Expel. So we already washed it, we already clayed it. Brian did a good job. The guy, uh, the guy is really showing uh, he's, he has dedication and he really likes what he's doing. So I'm really happy that he's on the team. So we're gonna prep the film, start peeling it off and uh, do the install. So this is the incision that I was talking about that we we're gonna do. So we could have a very seamless. Now I've seen some of these forerunners from the dealer and then when the dealer does their PPF, um, definitely, they definitely, definitely, definitely leave a lot of um, edges shown on this area and also on the, on the side areas as well, like on the edges, they won't tuck it in. And as time goes by, it does get um, very noticeable. So I got most of the fender already laid down. That's one of the last pieces that we got to do on this one. Uh, as I always do, I extended a couple of edges on the top area where it meets the engine, right here, where it meets the door. So give them a little bit of extra coverage and a more seamless look. Almost done here, lining this up really well. So while I'm busy here, I got uh, Ricky over there. He's gonna do the cap top because we're also doing the the two pillars on the side of the windshield, and we're also doing the cap top. That's another area that a lot of our customers get wrapped as well. Uh, a and B pillars and the cap top. That's the wrap edges that I was talking about. You get a little bit of hot water so we could uh, seal up the edge right here. All right guys, we made it this far. We are done with the Toyota 4Runner Lunar Rock. <laughs>